Well, crews restored power to thousands of Tulsa Metro residents today, but thousands of others still don't have any electricity tonight. Two News reporter Brandon Richard is showing us when the lights will come back on for them. Brandon. Well, Karen, crews have made a tremendous amount of progress. In fact, we're told some of them may leave the fairgrounds here tonight and start heading back to their home states as PSO expects 95% of its customers to have their power back on this time tomorrow night. Now, another thing people have been forced to deal with are traffic signals. Since the storm, traffic signals across town, across Tulsa, have been out. They've been replaced by four-way stop signs, but the slow-moving traffic creating long lines and a big headache for motorists. Officials say things should return to normal this weekend. We still have about uh, 25 or 30 signal locations that are out. Those are all in response to a lack of power. So when PSO is able to restore power to those locations, those signals will be restored. And starting on Monday, the focus turns from restoring power to removing debris. City crews will remove tree limbs and other green waste if and only if it's piled on or near the curve. Officials say crews will not be able to remove debris if it's located anywhere else on the property. And with 3,200 miles of streets to move across, officials say it's a process that could take weeks. Live in Midtown, Brandon Richard, 2 News works for you.